Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for November 5th of 2024 is titled Milky Way over Easter Island. So what do we see here? Well, here we see an image from Easter Island with the great stone statues that we see here. And those are believed to be about 600 years old and were built by a ancient civilization that would have put those together and built them. They're incredibly large, twice as tall as a human and hundreds of times more massive. Now, of course, even larger, we see up in our sky, we see the Milky Way there. And the Milky Way is, of course, our galaxy as we see it from within. Now, when we look out at the sky, pretty much everything we see is a part of our galaxy. So all the stars we see all around the sky are part of our galaxy. So when we talk about the Milky Way, we're looking at the concentration of gas and dust in the plane of the galaxy. Our galaxy is very flattened. And therefore, when we look in the direction of the way the galaxy is flattened, we see more material there than we see when we look in other directions. So the stars that we see all around the sky are just relatively nearby stars that happen to be all over the place for us. Whereas most of the stars that we see are very close to the plane of the galaxy. Now when we look at that we see a number of different things there including the dark dust lanes that make up a spiral galaxy like our own and those are regions that are blocking out the light from behind it so there are parts of the galaxy beyond this that we simply cannot see and that's because there is too much material in between us and those distant parts. Were that dust not there this would be extremely bright lit with the light of billions of different stars. But most of that is blocked out. We get some glimpses of it where the dust is a little weaker. And you can see those bright star clouds there prominent, especially toward the top of the Milky Way in this image, where there is less dust and more of the starlight is making its way through. Now also along the dust planes we see the red glow of hydrogen gas caused by the excitation of hydrogen from hot stars that have formed and you'll see a few small blue star clusters relatively young clusters recently formed that signify ongoing star formation within our galaxy. So all of this put together, our galaxy is a spiral galaxy. We don't see that structure because we're stuck inside it. But if we could travel the tens of thousands of light years above our galaxy and look back down on it, we would be able to see the distinct spiral structure of our Milky Way as we see in other more distant galaxies. So that was our picture of the day for November 5th of 2024. It was titled Milky Way over Easter Island. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Comet Mountain. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.